welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new hello hi i'm katie and welcome back if you're a subscriber you guys are the best today i'm going to be sharing with you six new pieces that i've got which are going to help you feel really confident and comfortable um, to work out in i personally love working out it just makes me feel really great i love like get my workout in in the morning it's my favorite time to work out let me know down below what time of day you like to work out um, and over the years my mindset around how I move my body has changed and I just want to share that with you before we get into today's video. So what I mean by this is I used to think of exercise as like a punishment for what I'd eaten or as like something I had to do because my body, um, like because otherwise I would just get fat basically, like um, I would just put on loads of weight and you know like and back then that was like such a terrifying thing for me um and then over the years i've done a lot of self-development work on myself and i have completely rewired my brain sort of patterns around exercise and I, it's now something i generally love to do i do it in an intuitive way so what that means is like I don't wake up every day and think, right, I need to sweat for half an hour, I need to sweat for an hour, I need to go to the gym every single day. I wake up and I feel, I, I, I think about what my body wants to do that day. Like I check in with my body, how it's feeling. Um, and I think, right, what do I feel like today? Sometimes I do feel like a sweaty hit workout. Sometimes I feel like a nice peaceful yoga class. Sometimes my body needs a rest, so I rest it. Sometimes I might feel like going for a walk. Sometimes I feel like going for a jog. It's like literally changed my life and it's really helped me feel good about exercising, which is something I guess I never did before. It was almost like something else on the to-do list that I just had to tick off um, because I was so obsessed with how I looked and I was just so fearful of becoming a whale. Let's just say it like it is. So as, as like I said, over the years, my mindset has changed and I really, really helped from doing this work on myself uh, I've actually got into a really healthy sort of shape and size for me and my body. So I just want to point out here, health looks different on everybody. And please do not judge how healthy someone is by how they look. Because you have no idea, like, other factors that are going on in their life, their genetics, you know, everything. There's so many factors that come into play between, you know, people's health. So... Please don't see a skinny person and just automatically think they're healthy, basically is what I'm trying to say, because this is the mindset I used to be into. Um, you never know, they could be starving themselves, over-exercising, or they could just be naturally so slim and they just live off McDonald's. So, you know, that you have, you just, we can't, as humans, compare ourselves to other humans. All we can do is know that we're doing the best for us, for our bodies, for our mental health, for our mental state of mind, because sometimes working out might be like so hard for us to do. It might take up so much of our energy. So you might need to find something that works for you. And the way you do that is try lots of different exercises, try lots of things. Like I actually did this um, like dance class workout the other day, which I have never done before. Um, I did used to dance when I was younger, but you wouldn't have thought that me doing the dance class. And it was so fun, but I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a different perspective on this before I go into sharing the clothes with you today. So um, I've not done like a haul style video on my channel in a while, so it's not really like that anymore. This is more of like some really lovely pieces. They're really high premium quality gym wear. The pieces are gifted from Squat Wolf. Um, I will leave everything linked down below, but I honestly can say the quality is so high of these items. Um, and I think investing in gym wear um, that makes you feel good honestly really affects one your workout because it affects how you feel about yourself um and it can really really enhance my workouts it can help make me feel a lot better within myself and it's just almost like a little act of self-love as well it's like you deserve to feel good while you're working out so maybe you know rather than getting a takeaway this week or maybe rather than putting money towards i don't know xyz that you're planning on getting this week maybe treat yourself to something that's going to make you feel good when you move your body and the reason you move your body is because you love your body and you appreciate your body and if that like sounds woo woo to you or that sounds so out of reach please make sure you're following me over on instagram um 
at with love and your underscores because i do talk a lot over there about how we can learn to rewire our thoughts from hating what we see in the mirror to starting to accept and then eventually start to like and potentially even love one day and if you don't love your body one day that's fine too it's all our own unique journey so let's get into these gorgeous pieces i also picked those some of them are great colors i can't wait to share them with you so just for you guys reference i'm uk size 12 and i'm five foot nine you always seem to ask um and I would say at the minute I'm on the smaller size of a size 12. So I went for a size medium. I have shopped and done a collaboration with the Scott Wolf before. And I think everything I got in that order was either a medium or a large. But this time I went for everything in medium. Um, because there's nothing worse than like yanking up your leggings is there in the middle of a workout. Or feeling like, you know, things are coming out. I'd rather everything be nice and secure and tight and in the right place. So I'm going to start off with these leggings. I'm absolutely in love with the colour. They're really, really just like a beautiful flattering material. I'm not going to lie, when I got them in the bag, I was like, ain't no way they are going on me. But <laughs> they do. They fit like an absolute dream. These are called the Core Agile Leggings and they're in the colour Clay. Um, so I'll leave the links down below so all the prices will be down there as well. Um, they are just like such a gorgeous material. They feel so lovely on and I think they are squat proof. I think they are squat proof, which is amazing and ideal. So these are the first ones I'm absolutely in love with. Next item I'm going to share with you is this gorgeous falling over is this gorgeous sports bra so it's a really lovely khaki green i'm loving all these like soft muted tones at the minute and i'm really enjoying bringing like more pastels and springy colors into my wardrobe um so this is a lovely khaki sports bra and the back is what's my favorite on this this is just absolutely stunning it is still quite supportive even though um it's you know quite open back because it's got this lower band and the straps on top so you do actually feel really nice and supported in it uh, this is a core, this is a called the core range um, and again I got this in a size medium it's a really lovely fit um, and yeah again it's just got really simple branding on which I really like I don't like too much like branding in your face it's not really my vibe and um, so this like helps just make me feel really nice I do just feel really nice and I've got like a a little I'm not really like a matchy matchy set kind of girl but I do like you know colors that complement each other and just makes me feel good okay next is shorts. Now, if you're thinking, I ain't no way I'm wearing shorts in the gym, think again, because here's fact number one, absolutely no one is looking at you or your legs or your shorts because they're too busy looking at themselves in the mirror, worrying about what other people think about them, worrying what, you know, their legs look like in shorts or trousers or whatever they wear to the gym. Or they're too busy just doing their own workout, minding their own business. People don't go to the gym to people watch. If you do, you're a bit weird. <laughs> so embrace the shorts, embrace the legs. When you're on your deathbed one day, you're gonna say, I'm so glad I went to the gym every day in leggings and covered up my legs and I found it so unbearably hot and uncomfortable, especially if you live in a hot country. Um, and for me in the summer here, even in the UK, I get super hot in leggings. So shorts are just a dream. Um, and these are amazing because they're not clingy. These come in loads of lovely colors as well. Um, again, I got these in a medium and the thing I love about these is they've got like this under layer here So they've got like this tight again the materials are the same as the leggings I just shared with you at the start so they've got this gorgeous like fitted Legging so you're not gonna have to worry, you know If you're doing anything like on the floor and your legs are up You don't have to worry about like anything being on show because they've got this under layer of shorts It's just amazing. And I thought this blush pink was just a really lovely like summery springy color um, But also quite muted so like not too in your face like I'm not really one for bright colors Which I'm sure you guys will know if you've been here for a little while if you enjoyed today's video Make sure you hit that little thumbs up if you're gonna wear shorts to the gym because I told you to Put the thumbs up. <laughs> Push yourself out your comfort zone. Honestly, I used to be someone who would never even dream of wearing shorts or a sports bra to the gym in my life. Um, maybe wearing them as a combo to the gym is still a bit of a push for me, but I would easily wear um, shorts to the gym and a top now or a sports bra and leggings. Easily. And it, all it takes is doing it once. Realising no one gives a shit and doing it again. And keep pushing yourself to do it. Once you've done it for a whole week, you won't even think about it. Your heart will stop fluttering. 
you won't feel so self-conscious and you'll just be fo focused on your workout. Trust me, trust me, trust me. And if that doesn't happen, do it for two weeks and it, you, will, you will get there, I promise you. Even do it for a month. Um, practice, start working out in your home as well, in, in things like this, so you get normal and used to wearing them. But these are a lovely, nice way to get some shorts in um, without them being too clingy. And obviously look great with little white tops um, and like mix and match with other sports bras really easily. And the next thing I've got to share you are these shorts. Now I already have these in black from the last collab and I love them because of the length on them. Um, like I mentioned earlier, shorts, especially on me, I'm five foot nine, so shorts on me, I find really, really short. Like, almost like my butt cheeks are coming out. And don't get me wrong, there's nothing wrong with that. We've all got a butt, get your butt out. If, you know, you should be proud of your butt. But personally for me, like, this is all about personal. And for me personally, wearing shorts with my butt out, I'll do it when I'm like in Bali or on holiday, but doing it in my hometown where it's not really that hot just doesn't feel right for me. If it feels right for you, you go and do it and I'll be proud of you. But if it doesn't feel right for you, that's fair enough too. So these would be an ideal if it doesn't feel right for you. So these are the Warrior Cycling Shorts. Like I said, I got these in white. I I do feel like these are a little bit see-through and I think that's probably because I probably should have gone up to the large in these. Um, however, they're just a great quality. The material is absolutely stunning. Um, and I think if you got your true size in these, they, put, they wouldn't really be see-through as long as you wear like a nude coloured thong. Um, you'll be fine. Because I do feel like with white sportswear, it's quite, it's one of those things that's quite difficult, but I'm probably more likely to wear these things like going for a walk, playing tennis. Like I'm probably not gonna be doing squats in white shorts um, or in the gym where they're gonna get dirty using lots of like machinery. If you're gonna be doing something like yoga, you know, maybe go for something like these. A really, really lovely combo. Next, I have these. I feel like a black pair of um, gym leggings are just such an essential for the wardrobe. These are really nice ones. These have like just the branding along the side. This is probably like the max branding I would go personally, but I do really like them and they're just a great addition to every wardrobe. Um, they're a really nice length. They're very flattering on. What I do have to say about these though is that they are not squat proof which did disappoint me a little bit but um they're absolutely fine you know if you're doing things like yoga or if you're just wearing them for a walk only if you're going to be doing squats where you're putting your bum out people are going to see that they're slightly see-through on the squats other than that though they are perfect okay my final piece which i'm probably the most in love with is this gorgeous sports bra I'm absolutely obsessed. I think it's really, really nice. It's high neck, so it's not, you know, got the boobies out. It did come with little cups in. I have taken them out. Didn't I just don't really like cups and things, um, personally. Again, got it in a size medium. Um, and it's just lovely. The back detail is really gorgeous. And yeah, I'm just super, super, super impressed with the quality again with them. So I hope today's video has been interesting for you guys and given you a little bit of a different perspective on working out, how you move your body, why you move your body. And if you're interested to learn more about these things, please just pop me a little DM on um, Instagram at with love Katie and let's chat. Let's look at ways you can learn to reframe um, the way you feel about your body and how you move it. So yeah, I would love to help you guys over there. So hopefully we'll see you soon. Um, thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for being here. All the links are down below as always and have a wonderful rest of your day. Make sure you hit subscribe for all those good vibes as always. And yeah, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a bit more back to my normal schedule soon. So I'm hoping to get back to at least every Sunday um, and potentially one day in the week as well, but we will see. I am only human and as this has been a bit of a shift in content for me, it's just been a little bit of like, right, let's just you know what it's like. You know what it's like. I'm going with it. I'm going with the flow. So thanks for being here. See you soon.